Hi guys and welcome to another video. So in this video we're going to talk about how to read uh, a file using uh, the stream reader in a different way which is a more efficient way. Okay, so we got this file 5.txt and we're going to be reading this file. So just again, so you, you need to remember that uh, I need to explain this in a more simple way. So the action uh, or the process of reading a file it's very similar to a loop so which means that we've done this until we met some condition so uh, in order to do this we're gonna have to use a while uh, while loop okay so and also we need to create a variable which is going to be our send now uh, let's call, create a, a variable called line it doesn't have any value and we're gonna write a while loop so we need to do this so be, uh, I'm gonna put two parentheses because we're gonna do line equals reader dot read line so which means that we are reading a line okay this function is going to read a line and we're gonna compare that to see if it's different than new so that's basically all and then I'm gonna print console dot right line line. So this this line here is going to read a line to the it's going to read a line into the line variable. This can this first part returns a the text and the bool, which means that if it is different than no, we're gonna continue until it it to the end. Okay, so let's execute, and we should be able to read the entire file. So you guys can see here. Uh, this is more. This is a little bit more efficient than using read to end because it doesn't load the entire file into memory. We don't need to have a string, which could have thousands or even millions of lines uh, but you, we can read line by line which is can which can be a very efficient way of doing things okay so thank you guys for watching this video see you guys next time